What's up guys and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy 9 We're here in wrecked Lindbloom as usual In the last video, what did we do? Oh no, we got to Lindbloom After getting Rama as a summon and then... What else did we do? Oh yeah, we got back here, we made the Regent Sid and then we're... Oh yeah, that's right, we're getting ready to leave town again So it's because we gotta go pursue Not just Queen Brown, we gotta pursue Kuja This Kuja's got the uh... Because apparently according to their plan, we need to defeat Kuja in order to prevent Queen Braun from like, you know, getting more weapons and crap Like the black mages and the spells and the, and the thing and the whatnot So I gotta talk to this guy here and he's gonna take us take us out Yup, whatever this is Braun's fleet arrives, uh oh That's not good Oh, I remember this! This is the part on... When I was a, when I was a kid, I, I played this on my PS1 and it came in four discs and this was the part on disc 3 when my game would crash, so everything from here on out is unknown territory for me. <laughs> I'm gonna take them all back to Alexandria. We're gonna go on a very long trip. Stop that chatter, keep loading the ship. Damn them, they, keep, they think they can walk all over us. They gotta stall more, let's keep working. Alexandria rules this continent now, where else can they go and conquer? What do they really want? I don't know, but you know how greedy Braun is. Hey, I get to play more. I finally get to experience parts of the story that I never experienced before. Yeah, I wonder where we're going next. I don't know of any kingdom that poses a threat to our country. I'm sure Queen Braun has a plan. There's no need for us to worry about such matters. Come now, we need your help. Some Lindbloom soldiers have locked themselves up in the guest room. Oh, I remember that. I remember, I remember that guest room. That's where Garnet used to stay. Hey, come on, guys. I like how they active they try to actively avoid Alexandrian soldiers here, but when I wander around in town, they don't do jack. <laughs> I can talk to them and they won't care. <laughs> On what Braun is gonna do. Zidane, do we really have to go to the outer continent? Hey, what's up with you? You see you wanted to go. What if What if something happens to you or Vivi? I'm not be okay on my own. I got Phoenix Downs. Are you worried about me? What? Well, I mean, um, and Princess needs early guards, you know. <laughs> that's that's bullcrap. If I ever heard it, I'd be stranded without you guys. Yeah, right. Are you trying to flatter me by calling me your elite guard? You can you 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 can control Rama. Hello. Sorry, I was only kidding. You'll be fine without me. What about you, Dagger? We don't know anything about the outer, con outer continent. I've made up my mind. I don't want my mother to commit any more atrocities. Alright then, I'll protect both you and Vivi. Thank you. Yay, Princess Elite Guard, whatever. Oh, we're, we're using these things again, huh? Zidane, I'm so glad you're here! Vivi was Uncle Sid. Um, he said, wait here and then went away somewhere. Where could he be? Huh? I did it! What? You did what? I stopped the trolley between here and the Serpent's Gate. That'll show them not to fool around in my castle. <laughs> really? Now go. The excavation site is like a maze. Be careful not to get lost. And take this with you. What? It's a rag. You big dope, it's not just a rag. That is a national treasure of Lindblum. That is an ancient map of the entire world. Ooh. Wow, thanks. Yeah, that's exactly what I'd say as well. Received world map. Yay! Now go before they find you. Zidane, Vivi, please protect Princess Garner. Okay. <laughs> Uncle Sid. Don't worry about me. I'm stronger than I look. Really? Now go. Let's squeeze all the alcohol oil out of my body if you're caught. Let's go, Dagger. We Oh! How infuriating! <laughs> I'm not gonna do that guac guac nonsense. Not. My my, they have an ogle for region and buffoons for soldiers. Why did it take so long to load supplies? Hmm. You two, I did not give you permission to rest. I understand that things are moving slow, but keep in mind that the next mission is about to begin. The machine over there stopped and the trolley stopped coming. Right? Yes, it made this strange guac guac sound. I wanted to go shopping before I left the harbor. Any word from the lookout? No, ma'am, nothing. 
That's what the region Sid's doing. He's hiding something. No. Oh. Come with us, you two. Find the regent. Yes, ma'am. They could jump. They could jump higher than their own bodies. Oh, here we are again. Oh, you yeah, have the merchant and the sage Mughal also here. Uh, let's see what you have on sale. A pawn shaped like a gourd. Okay. Nothing I can buy because I am out of money. Oh wait, hold on. I wait, hold on. Vivi's with me now. I can, I can do crap with him. Uh, let me see. Um, I could either have him wear the bandana, which gives him insomniac, or I can wear the matrix, which gives him loudmouth. I'm willing to bet loudmouth prevents him from getting silent, so I think I'll equip that. Uh, uh, Mithra armlet. armlet doesn't give him any abilities, so. I guess I could give him Bone Wrist to continue giving him that add status thing. Oh, he's Master Jelly. Very nice. Uh, um, I guess you could get, get defense. So I'm gonna go to abilities. Add status. Uh, loud mouth, yeah, prevent silence. Just what I thought. Uh, I don't know if you've got any more abilities. No, you don't. Yes, I don't think I have a lot of... Yeah, I know, I don't. Now, because of the Mithra Rod, I get... I messed up everything with the Mithra Rod, I just need to start a Rod. Okay, so I can sell the Mithra Rod to the shopkeeper. Maybe they'll give me enough money to buy something. Maybe I can sell the Ogre as well. Uh, where is it? There it is. Oops. Darn it. I keep forgetting that I keep forgetting that 2A equals I'm exiting out of the stupid freaking store. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh Adam, I don't have enough money for those. Ah uh, the place of being freaking broke. Alright, I'm gonna save, so I'll be right back. We're back. Right. Let's get going then. Out into the overworld. So I gotta head directly north from here. Um, directly north is this way, I do believe. And the shopkeeper said he'd, I'd find a lake shaped like a gourd. This one? Uh oh, that was unnecessary. Uh, okay, so, so yeah, yeah, this is the, th that's the lake that's shaped like a gourd. Okay, so it's here somewhere. Nope, it's not there. Um, uh oh, that was mostly annoying. Okay, where is this excavation site? I guess we gotta follow the. Oh boy. It's funny how Vivi, both Vivi and Dagger still don't go into the victory animations. Okay, so I am going the completely wrong freaking way. He said north from the Dragon's Gate. So. Ah! You know, I just realized that um, Garnet's weapon is actually a. What I think is a. F foosball? No. It's, um. You know what's that, that sport? Oh, there it is. Wait, is that a gate? the hell? What is this place? Q's Marsh. Well, they said it was near a swamp, wasn't it? Oh! Oh, I remember this place! This is the place where we can get that extra- that optional party member! You can... See that? That- that- that becomes important later. These- these ripples. So, uh, oh! Also here is where we can find, like, Moggy and... Mogster. Oops. No, it's fine. What do you do? I just need directions. The big leaves the outer continent. Yeah, just to the passage that connects to the outer continent. It's somewhere in this swamp. Ah, okay. Uh oh. Hello. Okay, so we can go this way. Going into the marsh itself is actually a maze. Uh, 
Because what's gonna happen is I'm gonna go in here and then it's just gonna give. I think it gives me a. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, it's a maze. So I won't be able to see where I'm going. Uh, uh, I'm gonna have to. Oh, oh. Uh, hi! Hungry. So, what we see here is someone's attempt to go and get food. And what we. Ah! What we have to do is to catch these frogs. I remember I remember this part well watching it, not actually playing it. We have to catch these frogs. We have to wait for one of them to hop onto the shore. Oh, hello. I think. And catch it! And then we give it to this weird person. Hello. You got frog. Frog's very good. Mm. Who the heck are you? Me? Hey! Welcome to our optional party member, Queena! She's a member of, well, gender unknown, but most people, pretty much, every, pretty much everyone who replaced this game refers to her as a she. She's from the, the Q tribe, and she uses the forks that we've been collecting all throughout this game as weapons. Queena, do you want this frog? Yes, yes. Uh, Alright, here. Yay! Queena received the frog and ate it. Mine, mine. Oh, hi. Quail, you pathetic queen. I can't even feed yourself. <laughs> I think I remember this part of the game, I think. Or at least I think I remember watching it or something. Get master art of eating, just chasing frogs, queen. Huh? But master, frogs very good. Frogs here best, better than Alexandria's. Queen, you in darkness need some light. They have like freaking savages or something. World, big place, many, many foods. <laughs> God, what the hell? <laughs> Alexandra, just one kingdom, you need to go out more. <laughs> I can't, I can't take it. I can't handle this. Eat other food. Go out into world? Sounds scary. Are there yummy frogs outside? Oh, duh. Of course, many good frogs. All cues love frog best. Eating frogs is key to growth. Q marshes exist all over the world. Go eat frogs in other marshes. I promise you get much learning. Traveler, please show Queena the world. Anywhere with food good. You wanna... You want me to take him with us to the outer continent? Her! Outer continent very far. I find frogs there. There's a plenty of stuff in the world that tastes better than frogs. Really, really? Okay, I go with you. And that's our optional. And that's our party member, pretty much. A new party member. Uh, what's up, Vivi? Um, that man looks exactly like my grandpa. Your grandfather? Who, the quail guy? Yeah, maybe he knows my grandpa. I'm gonna go talk to him today. Okay, we're going back in. Yo. What's wrong? Something on my face? <laughs> Other than those, those whiskers. Um, do you know a man named Quan? <gasps> I not know that bigot. Grandpa Quan was a bit strange, but uh, how do you know him? Uh, I know can't answer. Obviously you know something. Grandpa Quan looks exactly like you, Mr. Quail. Of course, we from same tribe. Uh, you really don't know him? No, I don't know this Quan, but <sighs> honestly? That's too bad. Let's go, Vivi. Okay. Oh, poor Vivi. <laughs> poor Vivi, I feel so sorry for him. <laughs> Keep in mind that everything now is like new territory for me, so I have, I have absolutely no idea what I'm doing. Or where I'm... Dinain, can I catch frogs? Frogs again? Sure, for just a little while. Thanks! And we're introduced to a mini game that can help develop Queena. So see that golden frog down there? Our our main aim is to kind of capture it. Oh, keep it. Hey, this is one of the mini games that can help you. I think develop Queena as a as a character. I think like her skills and such. Because uh, if once the game once the game permits me, and we go into the in, we can go to the menu. You're working hard, Queena. You come far along the way of Gourmand. I give you this. Or, yep. So the more frogs you collect in this minigame, the more 
the better rewards you're gonna get from from Master what's his face? Master Quail. Kale or Quail or however the hell you want to pronounce it. Come on. Come on, give me frog. Give me it. I, I think if I just stand there they won't. Because I have to wait for him to hop up into the shore like that. Come here! Ah! I'm big and hulking. Screw that. Head and up, Queen. I die catching. Yeah. So if I go to the main menu here, you can see that well, she has vastly more health than everyone else. She's level fourteen, and her class, technically her class in the game, is actually she is a blue mage. Blue, yeah, blue mage. So what? So what happens with it? So she can eat things, and the things she eats can give her can give her abilities. E is that the way? Yeah, yeah, that's the way. That yeah, that's the way the blue majors work. Yeah. So you eat enemies, you can gain their abilities, and I think if you eat and or kill them, you are able to. I think you're able to learn that ability permanently. So I'm 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 I've completely forgotten how she works because I, honestly, I, I haven't gotten past that one cutscene when I was on the PS One, so I've never had the chance to use her. Uh, so that high tide. Somniac and Jelly, right? Good. A full complement of abilities. We're gonna get, we're gonna get out of the marsh so we can save, and then in the next in the next session we will head for. Oh hi guys, we will head for the outer continent. If I think that session is that long. Wait a minute! No 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 wait no what? Yeah no wait no I have to get out of here so I can save first, because apparently the way to the outer continent is somewhere in there somewhere. Oops. So we'll save here, thank you very much for watching, if you like the video leave a like and a comment in the comment section below, subscribe to my channel for more gaming videos, and I'll see you guys in my next video, ta-ta!